Jill Mink and Jay Plummer are no strangers to cancer. I had a niece that passed away probably two, three years ago. She was only 33 years old. It was my brother's daughter. And then my sister came down with breast cancer, or, and uh, she's been fighting it. Mink says she's more than thankful her brother has been by her side through it all. You need a lot of support for this because it's, it's rough. You ask yourself why and what, and, but you know, you get your family, you start talking to them, they lift you up. That's what Concert for the Cure is all about, celebrating survivors. Negativity is not in my vocabulary. It's positive attitude all the way. Alexandra Navarro is a nine-year ovarian cancer survivor. I think it's very important that people that have cancer get involved in the community to help other survivors or other people coping with cancer. And remembering those who have lost the battle. Tonight, pink glow sticks lit up Kovaleski Stadium in a moment of silence. It's extremely moving. It's humbling. And it just reminds you how important it is that we work together to try to fight this disease. A sentiment close to heart to everyone here tonight. It's big hopes. Big hopes. So nobody else has to go through this. I don't want to see anybody else go through it.